Well, we're waiting for this guy. And uh, here we go. Dude, this thing is sick. A fearless leader, oh, wow. bro. <laughs> it got done. What time did it land last night? 4 a.m. No way. You yeah. stayed up till 4? Yeah. <laughs> Need a coffee? Yeah. I, well, I've had a couple. <laughs> Michael Potaker just got this thing done. Got this is our big dog for the Nora 1000. This thing's got all the bells and whistles. We'll get into it later. We got the crew here, Team Myers Manx, plus a lot of other guys heading down right now. We got all our shit curbside. The bay is right there in San Diego. We stayed at the Intercontinental Hotel and we're heading down to Ensenada for the Nora 1000 with all the boys in this van. This is our driver. What's up, dude? What's your name again? Marco. Marco. My pleasure, guys. Are we going to get pulled over in secondary? I don't think so. Not with me. Not with me. It's not what he said two minutes ago. <laughs> Nine out of ten, I said. <laughs> I'm a man of my word. Nine out of ten. So this might be a, a longer endeavor we want. Again, we're going to get more into this later, but we got to get to Mexico right now. Is amazing this is radical here we go here we go oh what is that you might ask that happens to be an electric Myers maze here she is god dang that's gonna be interesting disc brakes in the rear not on the hubs or nothing. Looks like a dual A-arm set up in the rear. Pretty cool. And, uh, ooh, some Wellwood brakes up in this girl. But this is one of the prototypes that Myers brought down here. So this will be, I don't know, this might be the only electric car down here racing. But, you know what? We're keeping it OG. Here's the hog right here, baby. Woo, she got a top put on her, boys. I thought we were gonna roast with no top, but she got a top on. And she's got a seatbelt now? Yeah, you know what I'm Thanks for putting those in there, dude, because originally this thing didn't have seatbelts when we saw it at the shop. And we're testing it. I know. It didn't have a bag, of, a rucks bag in the back either. What's going in that? Whatever you need to put in it. Cervezas? Your jacket, your cervezas, I don't care. Sick. Sick. Here she is, dude. I'm gonna do a quick walk around. Yes. This is the unit for a thousand miles. How many test miles you guys put on her? I think we got uh, almost 200 on there. Any in the dirt? You're looking at it. <laughs> That's She's ready to go. <laughs> Oh yeah. Oh, we're looking at about four and a half inches of rear travel, maybe five in the front if we're lucky. Yeah, if you count the cushion, you maybe get five and a half. Oh, okay. Gotta add the seat in there. So they're not cut and turned or nothing. The front beams just basically stock. Stock as can be. Stock as fuck. <laughs> nice custom bill signs on there. Other than that, you got your good old Jesus. Volkswagen. So basically. You can build this exact car for very cheap and go cruise the Nora next year in the slow Baja class exactly like I am for my first time this year. <laughs> I'll let you know how it goes by the end of this, but uh, 
Until then, we're gonna admire all these beautiful Manxes and all these vintage cars. What's up? My name is Blake Wilkie. This is my first time at Nora. We have a lot of experience in Volkswagen uh, Class 11 stuff as well as the trophy truck stuff with uh, the biggest, baddest Baja. Uh, my co-driver, Michael Squire, he shot the Baja Bug movie. That has a lot of history, including a lot of the, the Manx heritage as well as the Baja Bug. Um, this is Michael. Uh, you got anything to say? What do you think yeah. about this race? About Nora, Nora's great. You know, Nora is what started it all. If it wasn't for Nora, we wouldn't have racing in Mexico. We wouldn't have all the cars. We wouldn't have the evolution that we have today. And doing it in this Manx is something that's special because this is what started it all. When they won the first race in a Manx in 67, nobody expected them to do it. They laughed at them when they came up in a Manx in the star line. So to do it now with a remastered body, which is something that was all of the all of the Myers Manx bodies, they took them all, they scanned them all, and they took all those little pain points out, all those little things out, and made them to where it's the way that Bruce ideally wanted it to be. Make it easy to assemble in your garage and make it all uniform and even. So to be able to race this with this guy who's been bringing so much energy and life into Baja Bugs and Volkswagens, it's just a perfect pairing of bringing the old and the new together and doing it in a remastered Manx is the perfect way to do it. We're talking five days of Baja right there. Yeah. You guys are in the slow Baja, right? Yep. Yep. Yes, and sir. uh you guys took got toast strap for a safe kit. Yep. Yep. Bingo, bingo, right. bingo. Right on, GPS, right DHF, uh, got it all. Yep. Yeah, I think. Yep. It's in the center. Yep, right on. Not sure. What do you think? I think there's only two kinds of Volkswagens. Yeah. Ones that need rebuilding and ones that just got rebuilt. Yeah. This one just looks like it just got rebuilt. We're good, baby. It's a beautiful car. It's never touched the dirt yet. That's a beautiful car. Thank you. Shout out to Myers Manx. They're uh, not only sponsoring this event, but letting us handbrake, letting us race it. The little guy's pushing, right? Oh, yeah.
deserved beer, you guys. What's Thank going you. on, brother? We're officially the last <laughs> finishers. <laughs> I saw, you, I saw you guys, that picture of you guys hit that jump. Fuck, that was so badass. <laughs> stories again we were the last place finishers stoked as fuck on that all the cars are firing up looks like everybody's ready except for us so we should probably go do that and finish this here by Rito let's do it time to get going I'm dropping the <laughs> Yeah. What do you think about that beam? 
Nice. <laughs> That's why we've been crashing in the shit. Ah, okay. I've so going, from now on, I'll tell you left is right and right is left. I've been going the wrong way this whole time. Dude. You know, we can be going that much faster? Day two, 100 We're smashing. Mile 188. Smashing. It's been great. Look at these cactus, they're so sick. Jeep. Not sure where she's at, but she's coming. I cannot believe the shit that these things go through. It's <laughs> insane. It's so much fun. It's magical, I must say. Even though you can't see my lips moving under this thing, they're smiling. Yeah. Oh, my body hurts so Dude, bad. Dude, my fucking elbow. Your, your rear is uh, busted. 
something hanging down on the shock. Really oh, good. Oh man. Wow. Broke a shock. That explains a lot. Oh! That's uh. Not gonna do us good. Yeah, we got an issue here. Yeah, right on. I feel so. Don't tell me that. Let's trade it back in. We'll if not, I will buy a gas shock and we'll be good. It to looks go. like you hit a rock. You might have hit a boulder. Oh, dude, I, <laughs> I didn't see any of those on the trail. There were no rocks. Dude, it was sand all the way up. It was just really <laughs> big, Silt. really big grains of yeah, sand. All just, uh, they were a community of sand. I'll, I'll wait to hammer that with an actual hammer. We'll be all right. Laura is all right. We'll be all right. We're at the mission. Exactly. We're meant to stay here for a little longer. We need to find Jesus today. Yeah. Where are you from? California. California. See? I too. I live here. You live here? Yeah, my family for more than generations. Oh, tell me about the place. Yeah, it's, over here is two missions. The first mission, the lobby, mm -hmm. is Jetway Missionaries built in 1700. And the mission rocks in 1762. Yeah, you like the tour? I yeah. Like the tour? I have the hot springs so in my garden. You have a hot springs? I have hot springs over there. Yeah, some people yeah. like camping, go in the hot springs, shower. Yeah, we might be here for a little while, so we might go in the hot springs. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Hey, hey, Blake. Uh, Blake, there's, there's hot springs here. I'm down. So. It might be a little bit of a wait, but we brought our shorts. Yeah. We're going to the hot springs. We'll take a tour of the missions and yeah, ah, sure. beautiful. Thank yeah. you. Guess I'm here to waste my time. Washing my feet in the high tide Taking in the cold sunshine You ready for the palapa, huh? Oh, then you... On the coastline. Yeah? You've got every... Everything you need was already planted here hundreds of years ago, huh? By the Spaniards. And grapes, pomegranate, and olive trees, palms, date palms, is come from the Spanish, yeah. Oh. The blue palm is native, nativa. Oh, okay. Nativa, nat natural. natural. It's natural. native to the area. Yeah. Nativa. What, uh, what year was this settled by the Spaniards? What was the first year? The Spanish come 17 what? 1700 1700 yeah and then the second mission was built when 1762 1762 so 72 yeah. years later yeah good yeah. Cochi, me Indian is the natural the original Indian live here many 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 years ago and how long has your family lived here the, I come from my family come from to Indian Cochi, me Indians Eight generations before is the original Indian. So your yeah. family's been here for eight generations? Yeah. Wow. Uh, That's the original. Yeah. Not till the moon tucks away the tide in the way for you.
number on this thing. Sorry, Myers makes in the team, but we shall prevail. <laughs> I'm so worked, <laughs> but it's awesome. I'm excited for tomorrow. Excited for every day. Life is good. Hey Miles, we got one. Real good. Bradley, we good to slap this thing back. How was that sand in the last part? That was pretty fun. I think it's yeah. It's all over him still. Cheers. Cheers. Cheers.
after yesterday, I feel fed. We actually had lunch today. We had lunch. We had I gotta say, today. that's a big difference. Having a breakfast, having a lunch, just, just a meal. That, that really lifts but the But honestly, me. I freaking loved, loved, loved yesterday. It was just like, and going, when you said that, don't be pussies. Yes, yeah, guys, the fact. My car was hurt. The, the, the fact that Riley and I were like, it'd be great to have a cerveza, it'd be great to have tacos, and then we did that. Then we did that extra stint. Yeah, because we decided as so well. It's like the group decided, and we were like, all right, now we're all we're thinking about is beers right now. And then you came on the radio and said we can't. Do this. When, when, and we were like, when you called it, that was fucking do epic. Night. Doing that at night, just with you guys were in front of us. It felt like we we're on the moon yeah. at certain points. So, like with the, I mean, I had the, the, I had the camera. I had no lights. My lights were going like this, so my lights were shade up at the sky. So Which made it way more fun. <laughs> so, so literally, I was on low beam at the front, and it was just like literally, it was like, car was just like left, right, left, and I was like, that was it. There was no, it wasn't like it was back, dark in front, and then you guys came up behind me, and I was like, thank goodness. Yeah, why? That was, was such like, a rad experience. My tires were like I'm this. so glad we did that though. <laughs> well, yeah, you guys you, called it. You're steering right to left is. Oh my god, that was that. I think. Dimitri coming through. Yeah, dude. All right, so Michael's going for it again. I decided to get out since there's no front wheel travel and uh, he's driving like a bat out of hell. Here we go. I'm gonna try not to get in your shot. Um, if, if there's gonna be any action, it's gonna probably happen in those whoops after because it does buck pretty heavily. And uh, yeah. So the shot's here, right, Blake? Yep. Uh, back there, if anything goes sideways or that thing kicks like a buck in Bronco harder than it already did with us in it, um, and it swaps sideways, he's gonna take out a car. Maybe. <laughs> 
And uh, you know whose car's the Slow in Baja. the probably the worst place? Slow Baja. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> exactly. What are you riding? That's a lot of that's a lot of runway to slow down in though. Yeah. Or tumble. Or tumble. <laughs> slow down pretty quick in your tumble. Or tumble. <laughs> <laughs> oh. All right, Michael, give her the beans. What are you running in that for power? 1904. 1904. Yeah. Who built it? 1, Jeff Trebay at Gem VW. Nice. In fact, it makes killer engines. She's running good. She's she's got a lot of torque. She don't like the high RPMs though. It's got a torque cam in it, but torque torque is what you would want out here for yeah. sure. Yeah. All right, Michael, don't die. <laughs> You know, my jump I got way higher, but it was way le less risky because one, there's not whoops right after it, <laughs> and two, it's not as it's not going as fast. Here we go. And you didn't have the crowd. With this crowd. Yeah, in the in the pig, I had to do 60, 65 to get there. Obviously. Oh really? Yeah, but but the footage is pretty cool. Well, here we go. Actually, I'll stand back up. Coming in. Oh fuck, He's, he, he is full wooded in third. I think Remaster did it. Maybe me in the air did it a little, but um, maybe we hit. I would say it was the whoops after. I mean, we did go for a good a long time after that off road and then on the highway. I think it was that second jump. I think you need to shut your mouth. <laughs> <laughs> We, after the second jump, we did go the whole way off road without any of the issues or the sounds. Mm -hmm. It wasn't until midway through the road that they started. Right, so it's, yeah, this is the, why you can only ride these buggies off road or it's recommended. On road, they're not happy. They just like being off road. It's because we didn't stick to the dirt. It needs dirt, dirt don't hurt. Dirt don't hurt. <laughs>
made it to the finish line, ladies and gentlemen. We are here in beautiful La Paz, oceanfront finish line. Beautiful. Cruising. Nice warm welcome to La Paz. Consistently barefoot. <laughs> I ain't mad about it.
64, and the first win was uh, in 67, and here we are now in 2023, uh, finishing with three healthy cars ready for more. And my car was as stock as it can get. Right. Like, <laughs> it's a hoot. It's so fun. It's like stealing your grandma's car at 15 years old all over again. You used to do that all the time and just trash it. Uh, respectfully, yeah. I guess. It was pretty bad. <laughs> pretty bad, yeah. Right on here.